back to my channel. So if you are new here, I am Brie Yamauchi and welcome to my channel. So today I'm going to be doing a DIY rose gold hair. So if you want to see how I styled and what products I use daily for my everyday hair routine and how I got this rose gold look, then keep on watching. shower are this shampoo and conditioner. I really like this. This is by the brand Matrix. It's called Total Results So Silver Shampoo and Total Results Brass Off Conditioner. So this is the shampoo and this is the conditioner. The shampoo is like straight purple and the conditioner is like lavender, but I really like these. And I got these from Ulta when their big bottles were on sale for like half off. So I really like them. They're still pretty, pretty full. And for like a mask or like a balm or whatever you want to call it for your hair, I use this L'Oreal Elvive Total Repair 5 Damage Erasing Balm, Almond Plus Protein Plus Ceramide for damaged hair. This is from like their new line right now. I got this sent to me from Influencer and I really like it so far. Just a little bit goes a long way and I mix this in with the conditioner that I use and I've really been liking it. Now for after the shower, I use two products. The first one is by Pureology, and this is their Color Fanatic 21 Essential Benefits Spray. It's super good. It has so many like things to it. I really like it. And I mix it with this Too Chic Pineapple and Ginger Ultra Revive Super Potion Anti-Frizz Hair Serum. Hair Serum. And I got this from TJ Maxx, and this is from Ulta. So I really like these two together. And then after my hair is curled and all that jazz, I will use a mixture of this Tresemme from Control Hairspray. And this is just the whole three, like it's just a number three. And I mix in with the anti-frizz serum. I do a little pump and then I spray some hairspray on my hand and then I run it through. And then once I've done that, I'll go back in with some hairspray and touch it up. Now I'll show you how I do that. So I just take a little bit of that spray and then I do a bit, I do a ton of hairspray on my hand. And mix it together. And then I just run my hands through my hair all over. This is also to help like loosen any curls, defrizz, but also give a little bit of like um, hairspray as well. And then once I'm done with that, I will go back through with the hairspray and then just touch up and add in more hairspray. And I really like this hairspray. It doesn't really give it like a crunchy, crunchy hold, but it gives it a decent hold and I really like that. Now for dry shampoo, I will use the Batiste Instant Hair Refresh Dry Shampoo in the flavor coconut and exotic tropical and I will also use the one that's tinted blonde so I really like this one I got this full can from TJ Maxx I know that they started selling these at like CVS or even Ulta but I get it at TJ Maxx because it's way cheaper than at Ulta and I really like this so I will just take it and I usually do it in the center and then I'll like flip over but since my hair is freshly washed the center is good for right now. Okay, now on to the main part of this video, which is the DIY rose gold hair. 
So for the DIY rose gold hair, the one product that you need is this bottle right here. This is by L'Oreal Paris. It's Colorista Spray One Day Color for Tints, for Hints and Highlights. And this is in the color hashtag rose gold 02. Now I don't know if they have like an 01 or anything. I only saw this one from rose gold. And I've already used it and I really like it and it works great for me because like I said, I only wash my hair once or twice a week and I'm not using half or the full bottle for one day and then washing my hair and it's gone. So, it works great, I like it. I get my money's worth out of it because I, like, I don't wash my hair that often so it lasts a while and yeah. So all you do is you need to, if you want to be protective or wear something that you don't really care about, which I kind of already am, or if you are wearing something nice, just put a towel around. And it says, place a towel around shoulders to protect clothing, shake well before each use, hold can 4 to 6 inches from dry hair, and then spray. And then 4 says, wait a few minutes for color to dry completely, and it says, less is more, over spraying may cause hair to feel dry, I never really felt that. All over color may require more than one can. Again, this isn't that big of a can. It's only two ounces. And it works on both brunette and blonde hair, so let's just give it a go. So you take the cap off and it has a nozzle like that. And then you just shake, 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 shake. Shake it all up. Put the lime in the coconut and shake it all up. Put the lime in the coconut. So let's go. And they have a ton of other colors in this too. Like I really like it. And they also have a semi-permanent one that will last multiple washes that you can do yourself. That's like actual hair dye. But I might try that next sometime. But I kind of like this because it won't like last too, too long. I'm nervous. <laughs> I don't know why. I've already done it before though. Super cool, right? Now I apologize if I'm not looking. I need to look in the monitor because again, I don't have a mirror. <laughs> see how you can see some of it? If you look on your hand, it's like super glittery. So I just tried and like take that and brush it through my hair <laughs> to put it back in. But it kind of like stains your hand, but it'll wash off. I already did that before. So don't think your hand's gonna be stained because it's not. <laughs> so this is how it turned out. I love it. Um, it's a little much in certain areas, but it's okay because again, I didn't have a mirror in front of me, but I think it'll be alright. But this is how you get your own DIY rose gold hair or pastel hair or whatever hair you want because again, the L'Oreal line has so many colors and it's perfect because if you just want to try something new, it'll wash out the next day or in two days or three days or four days or five days or six days or seven days. You get what I mean. So I hope you guys really liked this video, and if you did, please give it a thumbs up, and don't forget to subscribe, and I will see you next time. Bye, guys.